He's cool. What? <gasps> Epic! Sorry, I kept you waiting. Oh, he's so cool! Ready, lads? Oh! My Go God, I love you, Dunben. Is that Dunben? <laughs> Dunben! <laughs> Time to move, people. This prison island Shulk saw in his vision isn't getting any closer. I love you, Dunban. I'm your biggest fan! Yay! We can send you to Aerith Sea in a flash of light. Are you ready to go? Yes. So beautiful. Oh, you know what? I was thinking that in my head. I was thinking that the sky looks like water. So this makes sense. What is it? That's the Earth Sea? <laughs> She's just going for it. She's used to it. He's scared. I mean, honestly, it looks kind of fun. Like, if you knew for sure that you weren't going to get hurt, like, it's fine. I would do it. I love those wings. Oh my goodness. What? That is so pretty. How is every single area of this game so incredibly stunning? Aren't you curious? About why we're going to Prison Island, I mean. It is not common for Homs to visit this region. You may have good reason, but forgive me. I do not pry into other people's business. It's definitely bugging her, Shulk. How, how dare you, you clown. That is so pretty. Is that? Like, look at the sky. You are looking at Prison Island. This game has the best skies in any game I've ever played, so by far. Do you guys see this? Do you see that? Hello? Do you see that? What? There's a meteor shower! And it's beautiful! Ah! Well... I don't know if these are good guys or bad guys. Who are these guys? Are those wings on their head? They must be high end here. Welcome home, Lady Melia. Oh, what? Thank you, Captain. These Homs and this Nopon are my guests. See them safely to the guest quarters. Give them anything they need. As you wish. Melia, are you? Melia. Princess? I will arrange for an audience with the Emperor. Will you wait? We won't move an inch. Oh, oh the thanks. Emperor is gonna die. At least that's what he says in his vision. He's like, you'll pay for killing um, Fiora and the Emperor. <gasps> More of these guys. Uh, what? What? They want to fight? You say the second consort's child survived her ordeal? Forgive me, first consort. I, Tyrea, vow to see your orders fulfilled. Whilst she's in the capital, do not underestimate the lengths to which His Majesty and the child's loathsome goons will go. Oh! I know this music is so... Uh, it's just so good! Melia Antiqua, first princess, has returned, your majesty. The Telethia reigned havoc on countless veteran knights. You triumphed where they could not. <laughs> I find it difficult to suppress these feelings of pride for you, my kin. The Homs and Nopon that accompanied you to the capital, they have been arrested by Imperial security. 
Shulk and his companions. Yes. Oh, so they did want to fight. To the weapon this Shulk possesses. You are to be the next ruler of the High Entia. Me? And not you? Yes. The Emperor asked for my counsel, and I told him as I tell you now. You will make a fine Empress. There is no one more suited to leading our people. You proved that when you dispatched the Telethia. I... don't know what to... Melia. But the soldiers... I am not fit to rule. She's too hard on herself. And beg for pardon. A fancy prison is still a prison. You are to be interrogated by the Divine Seer. Stand back. <laughs> Alvis! What are you doing here? <laughs> is Melia okay? We didn't mean to cause her any trouble. Rest assured, she is fine. The real reason you have been detained is not because you are outsiders. You don't mean... Yes. The Monado. You are free to roam the city or stay here and rest. Farewell. It is not certain that the Monado will bring about our destruction. While my sight is hindered, I have seen a sliver of light. Is your majesty not aware of this light as well? Are you referring to... Melia? And the young man, Shulk. Could it be that the boy is trustworthy after all? Kalyan, we are on the cusp of a significant moment. The investiture ceremony must take place as soon as possible. Might I suggest the trial of the tomb? First consort, such a ritual has not been conducted for generations. That child fought and beat the Telethia. It is my belief that she is more than strong. Mm. Besides, if it was revealed that she avoided such a responsibility, her reputation among the people would be irreparably damaged. Oh, yeah? Must protest. <laughs> uh, the first consort is right. There is much risk, but the rewards are greater. It would seal the people's love for her. Summon Melia. Her thoughts must be heard. So that's the High Entia Emperor, Saurian Antiqua. I will remain your Emperor for years to come. But now is the time to announce my successor. May I introduce your Crown Princess? And there's the lady herself. Melia Antiqua. It's... it's her. That's Melia? She's, she's a princess. For how long must I suffer these horns? Oh my god! Do your duty, Tyrea. As you wish. Oh no! Excuse me. We ordered room service an hour ago. <laughs> I'm afraid. I love Dunbin! Who are these guys? Shulk. These are inquisitors. What is this? Oh! This doesn't. Brother. This doesn't look good. Wait, this is His Highness Kalian, brother to Her Highness Melia. Wait, could that have been? No, there's no way. Kalian, Melia is in danger. She'll be killed as an altar if we don't find her soon. Killed? How can you be so sure? Shulk and I share the same gift. Another seer? Which would mean that you can see the future? That's why we have to find her. Now. I wonder what the significance is of that. 
both of them being seers. They must be connected Your in some way. As agreed, you will face the ritual alone. I thank you for escorting me. We wish you a safe return. <laughs> the way she says it. Who are you? My name is Dunban. I'm sort of the protector of this Mekon bashing band of horns. Dunban. I know you. At the Battle of Sword Valley, you held back an entire wave of Mekon with the Monado. You know a lot about a battle you never showed up to. My <laughs> apologies. We do not concern ourselves with... You can reach the tomb by transporter from the center gate. Her Highness has already entered. Shulk, you should hurry. Is this... It is you who will rule the High Entia, and likely be their last. Revealed ancestor, I... Go forth and rule, my descendant. <laughs> so the spirits look favorably upon you. <laughs> Explain yourself. Get the heck out of here. Are permitted to enter this place? A filthy Homs half-breed has no right to the throne. Excuse me? Oh, uh, we're about to. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Nope, 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 nope. nope. Here we come. Why should you care when you're about to meet your death? She had to put on a brave face for a second. Timing is everything. Oh! Hey, ah, done, Ban. What the heck? Oh yeah, I can't. I can't do damage. I love Alvis so much. <laughs> Why did you come? The Monado gave me a warning that you were in danger. I'm just glad we made it. Shulk, everyone, I thank you. You saved me. Ricky, smiley, smiley, Millie, all safe, all thanks to Hero Bon. <laughs> That's not how I remember. <laughs> Mother. Melia. Traitor. Your Majesty. You have returned unharmed from the tomb. The forefathers have spoken. But if it hadn't been for Shulk. Callion has informed me of what happened. This no music. To doubt your legitimacy to the throne. Believe in yourself, Crown Princess. Brother. Tomorrow will be the investiture ceremony. At the appointed time, you will become my successor. Be proud. I will. That got me emotional. <laughs> Shulk, you are the master of the Monado. But there is something that must be said. What is it? Long before our forefathers built this empire, two titans, the Bionis and the Makonis, fought a vicious battle. Is this known among Homs? Yes. It is told to us as children. The two fought and died, killing many creatures in the process. Their remains became our worlds, bringing forth new life on Bionis. That's how we were made. The Bionis shall awaken once again. All life born on Bionis affects the ether. The Mechon's assault is just the beginning. And these events were set in motion when you used the sword against them. We used it because we... Because you needed to. Without it, you could not survive. I cannot dispute this fact. Oof. I believe the inscription speaks of these That's... very events with the Mekon. I do not demand that you act as Melia's protector. But I would be honored if you would be her friend. No. This is my humble request. <gasps> That's so wholesome. It would be my honor. 
commence the assault on Bionis. Oh my gosh. Happen soon. By the authority of our divine ancestors, I, Melia Antiqua, am honored to accept the responsibility of becoming your next benevolent ruler. Should I be deemed unworthy of this calling, or fail to protect the ancestors or the Bionis, I promise here and now to throw myself on the mercy of you, the people. This is so exciting. And what did you see, Alvis? We have all the information we need. We know that such a Telethia cannot hurt them. You see? Nothing can befall him before he sees his dream fulfilled. Wait! Wait! Alvis? <laughs> we don't need her. Look at me! Look at me, goody two-shoes! Let's just see if you hold back the screams when his blade gets a taste of you. Uh, that is a beautiful mech. Please leave it alone. Machine to machine. What? I think he was just jealous that that mech was a lot prettier. <laughs> Members of the Imperial family must take two wives, one Homs, one High Entia. Oh! I am half Homs, half High Entia. Shulk, in less than an hour there will be a banquet in the palace. I would like you all to come. Oh, Ricky's so hungry, he could even eat Smilly or Luca. <laughs> there will be plenty to eat. Do not embarrass me at this If dinner. you don't show the feast, I will cry. Every time I play a game and they talk about having a feast, they never show it. <laughs> Shulk, what did you see? On that tower. On Prison Island. <gasps> what does the siren mean? Michael, they're coming. Oh! <gasps> Life comes at you fast. Guess we're not having a feast. <laughs> Every single time I play a game that they say they're going to have a feast, we never get to see the feast. But I want to see it because I like food. Kellyan, your sister's time has come. There is only one course of action left. <gasps> we will not waver from our destinies. Oh? No! <laughs> Tell me, what happens to my father? I have a feeling that we're not going to be able to fix this one. It follows my last vision. We're on Prison Island. Metal Face and your father are... Prison Island? Why would father go there? No. I must go to the palace. Alvis. Of what will happen to him and what he must do before then. I don't know how I feel about I you right now, sir. I did. During our ancient divination ritual. If he knows, then why? Because he is the ruler of the Imperial family and all the High Entia. We must respect his decision above all else. We don't need rules to tell us when to say I love you, Dunban. You're you the best. Familiar. 
your Don't biggest fan. Give up on him. The Emperor, your father, is going to die. Oh, that this is the air. Uh oh. Our forces can only take so much. I'm scared for. Oh, that's. Yep. Okay. It can't be. This is our first encounter. It is not you that I speak to, but your blood. The blood that shackled me. Oh, uh oh, he sounds mad. Then I assume I do not need to tell you the reason I am here. There is no need. Use it. Oh, that the weapon? Is the reason I am here, after all. Metal face scares the heck out of me. That light, it's Father. <sighs> Father? Who is this? That man has Welcome. some ears on him. True heir to the Monado. Huh? Who are you? Check that guy out. Is this... He's one of the giants, said to have become extinct eons ago. This is what our forefathers locked away. I am Zanza. And I have waited centuries for you. Imagine waiting centuries. Imagine. I forged the Monado. It is molded from me. All who wield the sword are made known to me. Oh. You made the Monado? Yes. I made it millennia ago to oppose Mekonis. But why are you imprisoned? The Monado controls the principle upon which life is based, the source of your existence, Ether. Master the principle of life, and all things will bow to you. Your power would be infinite. As you now know, the sword gives the wielder the power of foresight. And I myself once used that sword against the Mekonis. And defeated it. I... You're telling us you beat the Maconis with that tiny thing? I was just going to say... <laughs> is merely an illusion. Oh, okay. Form morphs to conform to the okay. Will of master. I was thinking the same thing. The comes from within. The Monado is the blade of the Bionis. The only force that can oppose the Maconis. As the wielder grows, so too does his ability to control all things. Yet there is still power trapped in the sword. The Monado is in shackles. Shackles? It is suppressed. You mean... We'd have to release him. If we wanted to re- oh! I'm really glad that it can't hurt people, because that would have... <laughs> yes, it was this constraint that gave rise to faced Mekon. Mekon which cannot be destroyed by the Monado. This is really cool, and I was not expecting this. It's like, really interesting. Can't have that. 
I can't stand Metal Face. I'm getting nervous. <laughs> These shackles. They must be the reason the Monado can't hurt people as well. Does that have something to do with the faced Mekon? You must find that out by yourself. Don't do it, Shulk. But Melia, why? Something's not right. The forefathers must have had good reason to seal him. I need that power. I thought you of all people would understand. I do, but it's just... Hold on a minute. He only said he'd release this new power. Sounds like a good idea to me. But... Melia, please understand. I must do what I set out to. The Mekon must pay. I mean, I understand where she's coming from, though. Why do they always gotta keep show? <laughs> Why do they have to show that? Young Shulk. It's wrong. I will not force you. I ask for nothing in return. It is your choice. I will. Uh-oh. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, this is so cool. He's gonna grow a lot bigger now. Based on the vision, I think he's gonna get larger. Your will shall be done. Let the oh, maybe not. Be released. Thought he was though. This party's over. It might have just been the angle that made me think he got bigger. Oh! It's him! Metal face! Sorry we're late to the party. What do you think of our leader's gift? How did you know we'd be here? What's that? The poor insects are a little confused. We're here for the old fool. If he's dead, he can't power up the Monado. You being here just an added bonus. <sighs> ah. Come on. A silver faced Mekon. Zanza. Respond, Zanza. I know you can hear me. I sense thought waves. Zanza, how many more will you sacrifice? Who are you to talk to me? How dare you? You know nothing. I am here to talk, Zanza. Ah! Nakon! You will pay for what you've done! Please wait. I mean you no harm. Give us back Fiora! Give her back! Yeah! I told you to stay out of the way! Boy! Choke! Uh, 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 weak, weak and pathetic! Without the Monado. Isn't that right, Jamban? What? 
Well, who are you? I know who it is. I have a feeling. How do you know me? I think it's that Let's guy from the fight. He moves like. But that's impossible. Oh, I have chills. So good. Cease immediately. They are not our target. Any final words? I can't handle this. <laughs> Father, uh, are you hurt, Melia? No. His wings clipped. Did you really expect to beat me? Emperor. I failed you. Heir to the Monado. Huh? Sansa, you're alive. Give me the power I need. I am now a mere shell. The power is already yours. What? The shackles have been broken. Wield the sword. It bends to your will. Think of your enemy, and the power to defeat them is yours. Ah. Oh my god, this is so epic. But also really sad. I don't know how to feel. Mekon. It's not over. The people of Bionis will never let you triumph. <laughs> oh my god! It's changing form. Be careful. We cannot withstand such power. <laughs> oh my <laughs> Okay Uh-oh. There's gonna be a phase two. I'm already- I'm feeling it! Unless he just runs away. You will know the pain and suffering you caused the Emperor and Fiora! What? Look at him! The Monado was changed! Good! Now you feel it. <laughs> Swing the blade to your heart's content. Don't hurt her. Wait. Is this what you truly desire, Zanza? I see now. It is as I suspected. You exist outside the pre-established harmony. Is that? No way. Fe Fiora. Ah! Fiora. You're still alive. Zanza. 
Lanza. You have not changed at all. That is clear. But still, I cannot... Just using her as a vessel! Too late. Again. I saw it. I knew it would happen. Shulk. Why? Why did this have to happen? <laughs> Father. Melia, the hope of our people. You must not cry. Don't say that. I don't care how improper it is. Let me cry. Melia. Why does it have to be me? <laughs> All it takes is to be half Homs. Is that what you think? You are very much mistaken. <laughs> but... To become the hope of the High Entia is a fate that you choose for yourself. As long as you remember this, it is certain that you will be worthy of that name. But remember this also. It is not because you are the hope of the High Entia that I love you. It is because... I love you. That I wish for you... to become that hope. <laughs> Heir to the Monado, I leave the sword... in your hands. The sword that my forefathers sealed away. With it, you can succeed. Your Majesty. Uh, Melia, uh, cry for as long as you must. But when, when your tears are dry... Oh my god. <laughs> I can barely see through my tears. Shulk, I. You'll have plenty of time to think about your empire and your people's hopes. If you need me, I will be at your side. But you are an individual. You are Melia Antiqua. And you can't let them get away with this. You're right. My foremost concern is making them pay. Indeed. Zanza. <laughs> I do what is necessary for the world. What? I could very easily have stood in for you. Your sentiment is appreciated. I see a storm on the horizon. I am still confused! Melia, how are you? What do you mean? If you were talking about father, I'm fine. I have no choice but to look to the future. You're stronger than me, Melia. Do not mock me. 
More importantly, it is time you tell me who she is. We've known her all our lives. We thought she was killed in Colony 9. Man, this is a crazy plot twist! She didn't even recognize us. She's not a Fiora I remember. It looked a lot I like hope we Fiora. can get her back. But if it was her, then I can't imagine how Dunban feels. I've been looking for you. So this is where you were. Shulk. Apologies. Was everyone worried? Of course. Me especially. Hmm? It's just... I've been thinking about Fiora. And I can't help wondering. Wondering what? You saw how Fiora acted. It was like she didn't even recognize us. Yes. It's unsettling. But Shulk, don't get me wrong. I'm not sad. Don't lie, Dunban. Don't. Even if she doesn't recognize me, I'm glad to know she's alive. Dunban. Dunban. You see, Fiora was born many years after me. And not long afterwards, we lost our father to a Mekon. It was left to me to protect and raise her, almost like a father. I was always jealous that she had you as her brother. Ah, yes. You and Fiora used to be inseparable. Yeah. Oh, wait. I, I... <laughs> I need to tell you something. I always thought if Fiora were to be with anyone, it should be you. Oh! What? But Ryan hangs out with her just as much as me. I'm a sap. Yeah, I'm a does. sap. But Fiora doesn't like him in that way. Oh. I see. He's oh. a nice guy. Reminds me of myself when I was his age. <sighs> Reckless and hot-headed. Probably why he's not right for her. Listen, Shulk. Yes? A lost life can never be returned. But she's alive. It doesn't matter that she's lost her memory. Yeah, I guess you're right. Fiora and I have spent our entire lives together. The memory of that can't have disappeared completely. This music, please help. It's up to us. We have to help her remember. Help me, Shulk. Help me get her back. You know I will. Okay. Let's go tell the others. I am so happy. Hold on. Hey, they're back. Have you gathered your thoughts? Yes. Sorry to be a nuisance. Shulk, you too? Yep. All thanks to Dunban. I'm glad. Forgive me, His Highness Callian summons you. You think something's happened? We won't know until we get there. So, I'm just really glad to know that Fiora was not a plot device, and that's all I have to say. <laughs> Our decision to ignore the Mekon assault on your homeland was wrong. Your Highness, does this mean? Yes, Shulk. We will face the dangers ahead <gasps> together. Yay! Which leads me to my request. After setting eyes on a group consisting of Homs, Nopon, and Hyentia alike, I realized an allied army must be formed. I ask that you act as ambassadors for the assembly of this force. <laughs> Tell me your thoughts, Shulk. I need time before I make a decision. Look at that, Monado. Look at it. Dang. We must say goodbye. Is that what you really want? Yes. But promise me, when you find her, you'll come back. I'll be here waiting for you. I don't know what to say. Thank you. 
I'll miss you. <laughs> You're supposed to come with us. <clears throat> Why are you still here? Listen, I'll keep an eye on Shulk for you. <sighs> Whatever can you mean? Does she have a crush? A risky strategy, letting Shulk go off and just hoping he'll come back to you. Shulk and I are merely... <gasps> yeah, yeah. But remember, the longer he's away, the more chance his feelings for you will fade. But once we find this Fiora, I will personally whisk him back here in a heartbeat. <laughs> Don't give up. What? What is that? What? I appreciate it. Great. Don't worry, Melia. I'm on your side. I am so... Brother? Sharla, if we go and get Fiora, how is that going to work? Your Highness, Crown Princess, as your humble subject, I formally request the following. Speak. I request that you accompany Shulk in his quest to find the Mekon that attacked Alchemoth. Are you sure? Shulk, I am aware of everything. Go forth and follow your heart. Aww. There will come a day when we need you. But it is not today. Zanza is not dead. I feel it. Our tragedy unfolds once again. Lady Maynard. Does that mean? Indeed. I do not doubt Lady that Egil too is aware. However, why free the Monado? Zanza must realize it is now a double-edged sword. And what reason could he have for choosing the boy? What is this? I am experiencing... Whoa! Feelings for the boy? Lady Maynard. Venea, your swift repairs are appreciated. Oh my god. Thank you. I wish to see that boy again. Ah! To meet with the one who wields the monarch. Oh my god. The boy. But my lady. See, how can you not ship them? How? He is not. As my lady wished, he knows nothing. Then, there is no need to worry. I shall meet the boy. Besides, the Monado will draw him to me. Flying off without me, huh? Oh no, 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 no. From somewhere. Of course, I remember you. You're Jungburn's little sister. So this is a uh, pretty cool area. Oh wow, that was fun. Oh, this is fun. Oh my god. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, no, it's not. <laughs> hey, so I accidentally forgot to save the Twitch VOD for this part, so I'm gonna do a little voiceover for these scenes that I'm missing. But uh, basically, we find out that the face mechon is Mumpkar, which I expected, to be honest. And we fight him. As you can see, and then this mechon comes down, and we're like, oh, heck. Who the heck is that? <laughs> uh, and he looks really scary. And we find out that one. it is actually some guy named Egil, as you'll see in a second here. And uh, we find out that it's one of those games I'm where the main me. antagonist is not who we think. But that's Leader okay, because I enjoy a plot twist. An agent of okay, then if they're flying off. And I was shook by this part. Uh, it was just really intense. This music just kind of gets me in my feels every single time I hear it. It's just really good. Uh, then they fly off and they invite us to come over and we're like, yeah, we're coming. 
<laughs> Obviously, we gotta save Fiora. And then, uh... Shulk screams. And it breaks my heart. Um, okay, so then here... This is the Mumcar Fight Park 2. And, uh, as you can see... Dunban wants to kill him, and to be honest, I wanted to as well. I think he deserves it, but, uh... <laughs> Shulk stops him. And is like, no, 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 don't kill him. He's a human. He's not... Yeah, he's not a mech on. <laughs> uh, and... And... Uh, yup, so... We draw our sword and we decide not to kill him. Or not draw our sword, but you know what I mean. Anyway, he dies anyway! Because this falls on him! <laughs> And naturally, I was freaking out right here, and I wish you could see my reaction, no. but, uh, yeah, I'm so sorry no. about that. Rest no. in peace, Mumcar. Okay, so this next part was part of the recording that I lost, but shout out to my Twitch viewer, Supreme Brawler. He is the clip god, and he clipped this whole part for me, and thank goodness, because if he didn't, it would not exist, and it's such a good part, so, uh, yeah, enjoy! I cannot allow this. That boy is at risk. Shulk! Don't let him die! <gasps> Help Shulk! Help them! Who are you? This is the end. Heir to the Monado. Whoever you are, please lend me your strength. I won't let you do this! Fiora! How dare you defy me! Worthless machine! <laughs> Fiora! Thank you. No matter how much you yearn for revenge, I will not permit you to have your way. <gasps> the Monada? She'll get back here. No, that is not possible. <sighs> Come on, wake up. <sighs> she needs water. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't handle this. Oh, my God. This is gorgeous, excuse me? Fiora, you're awake. Um, do you remember? My name is Sh I can't believe it. Oh my god. My first kiss. You do remember me, Fiora. Of course I do, Shulk. <laughs> mm. Thank you. Welcome back, Fiora. I'm glad to be here. <laughs> what do we do now? We have to find the others. Um, we were beaming the PS5 like 10 minutes ago. I know, I know.
You can like see the wet. Well. <laughs> I definitely did not cry onto my shirt. That did not happen. Um, okay.